back, ladies and gentlemen. This is no ordinary interview because this interview is with a winner and with the winning team, of course. Excali, how you feel, man? I mean, obviously, a great feeling after winning the finals, after winning a nail-biting finals. It could have gone either ways till the last moment, but it's a it's a good feeling that I'm winning again. Let's go. <laughs> Well, uh, with the interview that we did have prior, you mentioned the fact that you're confident, right? With this finals being a potential 3-0 or, or even a 3-1. It went the distance, man. It looked sweaty. Can you talk to us a little more about the grand finals? Mm, obviously, because we haven't practiced since days. Since the day I joined, I don't think we have practiced. We have just focused on our individual skills. That's all. And I think we did manage to put up on a good individual thing today but uh, some of the other way those guys managed to take two maps out of us but I think it's still a progress for us because we are a comparatively a new team I mean not even a team I stood in I, I came in right now and Wakle stood in instead of Deadly so I don't know I, what I was expecting but uh, here, we, here we are we won <laughs> I mean, considering you're one of the two teams that made it out of the playoffs and the other being Revenant, what's your opinion on your uh, counterparts from the South Asian region? I mean, obviously, they, they played great. Uh, they're a good team. They have been practicing. They have been screaming a lot. And I have seen, seen, them, seen, seen them grown up because the Revenant which I saw on the first day and the Revenant which I saw today was a whole com complete different Revenant. So I think even they are progressing, they have two different players, two different players from uh, other regions, that are, which is Philippines. So it's obviously <clears throat> the initial phases of the team synergy building is hard and I think they are doing a pretty good job now. Well, that sounds brilliant, man. Considering that you're going to face off against Bleed and Boom, is there any special prep that you're planning to do alongside BLT? Any specific strategy that you're trying I to target? Mean, yes, of course, we are going to plan something special because the way we play today is not supposed to be the way we play in the playoffs. We'll, we'll, get, we'll get thrashed 100%. So we'll have to come up with something special and I'm pretty sure our coach, Davy will come up with something and uh, let's see what we come up with. And I'm so glad that you mentioned your close Davey, right? Because he's been a crucial part of building this roster of VLT back up to success, back to the glory number one days. So how do you feel uh, about your coach and what kind of impact has he put for VLT? I mean, obviously he's a good person. Uh, he's a good coach because I have four, four or five years ago, he was my teammate when we played Counter-Strike. He was my teammate and now he's my coach. It's obviously a good feeling to have someone like him who guides us, who guides everyone, who does their mistakes and he explains it to us in a very calm way so that the players don't get, you know, thoda asa. they don't overthink to do mistakes or anything. They, people won't get scared to do mistakes, is what he tells us. Okay, that's so brilliant. That if, if you don't do any mistake, the, you cannot win. You have to do mistakes so that he, you rectify those mistakes and just get better. Well, like you said in your previous interview, right? You need to take a lot of losses to get that one of crucial course, yes. win. And talking about crucial wins, you know, heading into that league stage where, again, you're playing against Bleed and Boom. What is the expectation that Velocity have set for themselves entering the finale stage? I mean, right now, I don't have any expectations because we have as i told earlier we are a new team and those guys have been in the scene since a very long time for example the bleed guys they've been one of the best in asia uh, SEA. they have been very dominant in this recent months but uh, i think if we play off our individual skills and you know communicate better and fix all these mistakes which we did today i think we'll put up on a great show and might win also well, we're certainly hoping, man. Both me and CA have been hyped about the possibility of a South Asia versus Southeast Asia finals, which it sounds romantic in nature oh, almost, course. right? So we're truly going to be rooting for you. And hey, any special uh, shout outs before we do get done with this interview? I mean, there's this uh, shout out to all the fans who have been supporting us, who supported us in the finals. Thank you, each and everyone, for supporting me, supporting VLT, the entirety of the VLT, everyone. Uh, I hope. We keep delivering the performance as we are right now and I hope you guys keep supporting us throughout the Penta event. Thank you so much. Well, you know the old adage, right? 
party hard but work harder well you have a lot more bank in the buck uh, you have a lot more buck in the bank right now so yeah man enjoy your sunday night and be ready for bleed and boom you at home be ready as well and be ready to catch vlt on the live action on the server feel the velocity